People of crypto, people of DeFi, welcome to the channel, Gray Adam 66 I'm your host, Bran, coming at you with a, another Casper video. I took a two-day break uh, because of recent stuff going on. I don't really like to uh, make my content about that sort of ordeal, and I've noticed a lot of people are subscribed to. Kind of talking about, you know, what's been going on recently, which, you know, my prayer goes out to everyone that's affected in um, Israel. You know, I pray that all parties involved find wisdom and find a love for thy neighbor and i really hope it comes to an end soon i hate seeing children um i hate seeing children have to go through what they're going through over there and especially women and children i, I pray for them i pray that they get out of there I don't get i just don't like that okay um and i don't know i don't really care if um how if that affects the crypto market the only thing i care about is that coming to an end i hate seeing families Go through that kind of thing. go through war i don't like that um you know i can care less about the price of crypto to be honest i'm, I'm in crypto for long term i made that very clear in my last few videos um but yeah my prayer my, my prayer goes out to all of them like i just it, it makes me sad for sure um now caspa is currently number 46 we were number 44 we did go down a little bit we're down 15.4 percent on the seven days so we're just going through a little bit of a dip phase. I mean, it's literally every crypto, um, every blockchain, every cryptocurrency, every token, every blockchain, every crypto goes through this after, you know, they go to all time highs, right? So past uh, 90 days, obviously, Caspa did a big pump and now we're seeing it go down a little bit. And I bought the dip um, just last night, you know, I, I bought, um, I pretty much tripled my position last night and i'm probably going to triple my position again very soon um caspa is something that i see 100 percent long term like that is and i'm going to talk about that there's a few tweets that i'm going to share with you guys because right now guys i'm just watching caspa daily that's all i'm doing caspa is the only crypto that i've been watching and the only one that i really care about right now um now obviously there's some other cryptos that i hold but you know for them it's just you know i'm not as interested as i am in um them as i am in casper currently if you're not if, if you're not familiar with what caspa is caspa is a proof of work blockchain just like bitcoin um there's no insiders there's no inside companies on um in caspa it's completely decentralized completely fair launched and normal people miners mined it globally to create the network known as caspa today and it was a fair launch so um, when you look at Caspa, it is not something you can deem a security. It's something that is comparable to Bitcoin, but also more scalable in Bitcoin and solves the trilemma of problems that Bitcoin has had. And it is a very big deal. And I think it is what is going to um, be one of the main, just the main players in the next bull run, especially right now. Currently, you know, there's something that I want to, you know, swing off with that too. Caspa, shout out to Caspa News. It says Caspa is ranked top 44 project by market cap 46 right now and it says without the participation of many top tier exchanges so there's no binance no coinbase no kraken no bitstamp no bitfinex no htx no gemini now you can use changer now that's what i use you know um but right now guys we're top 50 no exchanges zero big exchanges listed that is unheard of right um what caspa is doing is it's it's making waves without even having any of the e exchanges that make it easily access accessible to buy it's making waves and it's crazy because it's became so such a big project in such a short amount of time but it's at ground level to where the potential is in my opinion um and and shout out to um, Dag Knights on Twitter. He made a post that I thought was very interesting as well. And it is a, it is a similar um, train of thought that I have. And he said, someone asked, are you really comparing Casper to ETH or BTC based on market cap? And absolutely, like absolutely. Because um, where Bitcoin is now, okay, obviously Bitcoin's going to go to a million dollars. It's currently at 27,000. One of these days, Bitcoin will be a million dollars. It's not going to get there overnight. Don't get me wrong, but it, it will It will get there. It is digital gold. It is digital protection over your money. And so is Casper. It's full of decentralization. It's you own your money. You don't got to pay insurance on your money. You don't got to pay tags on your money. The government can't come and take it. It's your money. Nobody can touch it except you. And that is what is very important, and that is what makes it 
so valuable. And it says, um, his response, he said, yes, I'm talking about potential. Remember, every giant starts from zero and we're not at zero. We're currently at an $800 million market cap. And it, but it says, it's not just about current value. It's about the promise of what's to come, right? And what is that promise right now? I don't know what the promise is, but I do know the facts. And the facts is that Caspa is not a fork of any other chain. It's unlike any other chain. It is one of a kind. And it is something that I feel like people are sleeping on right now. And if there's plenty of videos out there. If you want to learn more about Caspa, please do your own research and look more into it. Because I, I didn't look into it um, at first. And then more, the more I looked into it, the, just, just the more I fell in love with it. The last tweet I'm going to share for this video is the longer term holders that have been holding Casper for over a year have started selling recently. And that is a main reason behind the big, you know, down pressure in price, which is very normal. Um, um, rock the Casper here. Let me give them a follow. They said longer term holders started selling on the 5th, leading to the plunge. That's um, that selling reversed yesterday. Let's see if they are done. We'd like to see this trend up again. So that's what he's that's what he's sharing. and. Um, What's very important to also remember as a catalyst is right now mining Caspa isn't profitable as it was or profitable at all right now. Mining for Caspa is very expensive. The miners are very expensive. So that's just another catalyst that you have to have currently. And the people that are mining Caspa right now, they're, they're long term. Like people that are mining Bitcoin right now and not making a profit, they're long term. And that is how you got to look at it. Like you do not want to play the two month game, the three month game. You want to play the five year game, the 10 year game, the 20 year game. Me, I'm here for the 20, 30, 40 year game. I'm going to play this through. I'm going to do this as legit as I possibly can and take everything one step of a step at a time. Um, because that's just what, you know, this, this is a passion for me. It's not even like, I'm not just in crypto or anything like that. Just to like, just to get rich and be done. Right. Um, I want to help people. I want to be able to do things with my life that and have impacts on people's lives that I, that have not been able to impact have an impact on me. And I just like to do more with what I know that I can do. You know, that's just I don't know if that makes sense, but that's just where I'm at um, right now, guys. Uh, I don't know as far as the crypto market whether we're we're going to go up or down this next week. As far as Bitcoin or anything else, I just know that long term we're going to be fine. Um, but right now I'm just looking and right now I just don't know what to think of it. Bitcoin's currently down 1% on the day. That's, that's all I got right now. Um, we'll see what happens within this next week. Maybe things will get more interesting as far as price action, but we'll see, you know, whether Bitcoin goes to 50 K tomorrow or goes to 20 K or just stays flat, you know, still long-term as always stay sexy, stay active. I'll see you guys in the next video.